how to add table of contents in MailChimp. Hello guys and welcome to this new tutorial. Today I'm going to show you how easy it is to add a table of contents in your MailChimp uh, email. So we are going simply to visit MailChimp.com then we are going to log in into our account. Make sure that you have signed up or signed in also for the uh, account on MailChimp. Now we are only going to set up here everything. So here by everything, I mean the contacts. Go ahead and set up your contacts, add them. Then we are going to click on add contacts like this. Import contacts from a file, copy paste, or uh, here we have the third choice, which is uh, getting the uh, from uh, the contacts from other services. Uh, also, we can go ahead and add a single contact from here. We have the email, which is required, of course. What is a uh, email campaign without an email? First name, etc. Don't forget to click on Add Contact, and boom. Now let's go ahead and head over the creation. We are going to click on Create. Then we are going to choose regular email. Click on Design Email, and now we are going to see here all the templates and also the steps that we need to do to set up our campaign. It is very easy. Here. The two or the recipients will be the subscribers. Go ahead and edit your recipients and make sure that you have make ever made everything good. Uh, if you want to exclude or segment your audience, it is uh, optional. From here, we have the sender. Here we have our email address and a little disclaimer, guys. Everything created in this video, such as email address or accounts, are created for the sake of the video and not for any personal uses. So. Here we have the subject, which is the most important thing to not let our uh, email go to trash. For example, let's go ahead and put here newsletter. For the uh, preview text, you need only to put it here and make it a little bit uh, prioritizing so it will not go to the trash again. Now we have the send time. You can go ahead and schedule it or send it right away. Now for the content and the most important part, which is the email template. We are going to select one of these free email, uh, email templates. We have paid and free. In my case, I will go ahead and delete this. So we are going to delete all the blocks that are not necessary. So let's go ahead and add a divider. Also a divider here at the top. And between those dividers, we are going only to add something like let's go ahead here and add a paragraph or a heading so we are going to put here monthly news or like this news letter then we're going to put it like this now i'm going to add an image block this image block should be um, added by an image or we are going to add an image to it so we are going only to add this one Go ahead and choose it, insert, boom, there we have it. Now, to add the specific here um, a table content, you need to name the sections. So here I have added some dividers. So we are going to add, for example, headings under the dividers. Then we are going to put, for example, an image like this here after the heading. Then I'm going to add another divider to make sure that everything will work well. And the newsletter will be uh, holding a lot of uh, content. So we're going to add here an image. Also, we are going to add another heading because this is the correct method. So for example, here we are going to put, let's say, a direct message. And here we are going to put, for example, here, um monthly statistics that is six so we are going right here to select here the text go ahead and click on the type of the text now we are going to set the type of the text to something more like so right here go ahead and change the uh, type or the style of the text right here to a heading for for example like this then we are going to change this also to heading 4 this one to heading 4 
Now we all only need to add something right here and select the merge text. Select here, uh, for example, or add here a text, for example, a paragraph. We're going to add a paragraph view and this, for example, in this email you will see. Then we are going to add the click on merge tags. Now we are going to uh, here present to the end and we are going to click on a table of content. There we have it. Here we have the table of content. Now we are going to click on exit and save. This is how we can add the table content. We are going to resume this save and exit. We're going to wait for here to the app to respond. In the previous versions of uh, MailChimp, We've, we've had for something called here on the heading talk or a title talk here. So right here, it is uh, replaced within the uh, heading three, for example, like this or heading four. So we are going to select heading three. Then all you need to do is to click on save and exit again. Then this uh, here table right here will be mentioned within these letters. So you are not going to see that right here but the senders or the receivers will see here the content like this monthly newsletter direct message monthly statistics and etc that was all for today's video thank you guys for watching i hope that you have enjoyed the content i hope to see you soon on the next one